Is this yours? Uh, it's yours if you need the translation. Uh, yeah. I questions in French. I set up an English for you. Uh, so you hear the okay. translation to English. Okay. So this is the same for you. I set up the translation for English here. Okay. So if anyone asks a question in French, but probably it won't happen. But if, if you can hear the translation here. Okay. So ladies and gent gentlemen, we are just about to start, so please uh, take your seats. I would kindly ask you to turn your mobile phones into the mute mode. I would also uh, kindly ask you to limit your moves during this uh, and sounds during this press conference. We are in a hybrid press conference room, so and we are online on my info, so it would be much appreciated. I would like to welcome here today the gold, silver and bronze medalists for the men's marathon competition. It is my pleasure here uh, to welcome with us uh, the gold medalist and new Olympic champion, Tamirat Tola from Ethiopia. Uh, also, I'd like to welcome the silver medalist, Bashir Abdi from Belgium. <laughs> I think applause for all of them, it's, uh, yeah, it's well deserved. And uh, the bronze medalist, Benson Kipruto from Kenya. Ladies and gentlemen, just before we start, a uh, few facts. Uh, Tamir Tola just adds, adds the gold to his bronze medal from uh, Rio Olympics, where he won the bronze for 10,000 meters run. Uh, he broke uh, also today, he broke the Olympic uh, record by six seconds. So it's a fantastic achievement. Uh, for Bashir Abdi, he adds uh, this silver to the bronze medal in marathon that he won during the Rio 20, uh, 2016. And for Benson Kimpruta is quite an achievement because uh, it's his debut on the Olympics, so, so medal in the debut, it's, uh, it's quite a thing. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, I will now open the floor to the questions. If you have a question, please raise your hand, wait for the microphone. Uh, our fantastic volunteers will bring it to you. Uh, and then please state your name and surname and name of your organization and who your question is directed to. Now I open the floor to the questions. Thank you. Stephen Granger from Sportsnet, uh, Sportsnet Africa. Uh, based in, in South Africa and Kenya. Just a question for, for Tamarat. Um, did the fact that you were omitted from the team, uh, the original selection, and you only made the team after Sisalema withdrew, did that provide you with extra motivation to see it to, and more determination to win the race today? Okay. <coughs> Thank you very much. Uh, since I am injured on training, I'm a uh, reserver for our team. Uh, but since I said I'm injured, so uh, better to go to Amrati, he said. So uh, at Vainadi, I in the team to come to Paris. So I went today, I'm very happy. Jonathan Gold here from Let's Run.com. Question for Tamarat. Congratulations. When did you learn Cisse was injured and how did it affect your training? Had you been training for the Olympic marathon or were you training for a different full marathon? Uh, yeah, thank you. Uh, I'm uh, in uh, Olympic, tam Olympic team uh, training with together. I'm a reserver for my country. So when he injured, uh, we, we, as the first we uh, training together, 
uh, in, uh, in one team. Uh, so after he injured, he replaced me. Yeah. Elias Makori from Kenya. Congratulations to the three of you. Maybe a question to each one of you. Bashir, um, how did you prepare for this marathon? The course was quite tough. We saw some uh, very hilly sections that, uh, you know, claimed people like Eliud Kipchoge, Kenemi Sabekele. Did you anticipate these kind of conditions uh, coming into this, uh, you know, marathon? Um, so um, I was uh, beginning of the year injured. I had a stress fracture. And uh, after I uh, recovered from the injury, I went back to Ethiopia. So I was uh, preparing well in Ethiopia. Um, I also saw uh, Tamara Trola training with the national team. So they, I think he was always training and uh, um, he was hoping to come here. So I, uh, after good training in Ethiopia, I, uh, we switched, uh, we went to uh, South France, which is uh, Formule. Um, and it's also up and down hills. So we don't train specifically uh, um, hills, but uh, we just train how we train um, in the past, and uh, um, I actually expected the, the up hills will be the most challenging one, but going down was for me the most challenging today. Um, so because it was really so deep down, you don't have only you don't have any control of your body. You just <laughs> so I, everything was hurting my knees, my lower back. And uh, by going down, I lost the uh, contact of the leading group. And as soon as it's flat, I, I, was, I, was, yeah, I was pushing back to come back to the, to the leading group. And so that was tough. And I, I, we just trained the way we trained in the past. The same question to Tamirat about the conditions. You saw when you were going downhill, you relaxed your hands a bit. Uh, did you expect this sort of uh, condition? Were you preparing somewhere in, in total for this, uh, you know, downhill and uphill? Uh, <coughs> yes. Uh, the, normally in Ethiopia, uh, there is uphill down. In Sandafa also, around the Tafo, around the uh, Sandafa. Uh, we done by team, by team this training. So uh, when I come here on the competition, it's, it's difficult when I arrive on here. Uh, but I not put in my mind to this is hill. So for all, so I go in front. Uh, normally like training, uh, but when I finish the hill, uh, it's, it's difficult to downhill. So uh, I put in my mind, uh, uh, I, I guess this is not difficult, I said that. So uh, finally, <laughs> I finished the downhill. Uh, it's another course is better for me, not, not, uh, not challenge me, just like uh, normal. Yes, for me also I was preparing for, for these Olympics with the, with the same conditions, um, running up uh, and down. So uh, I did some uh, preparations in uh, downhill and also in uphill, because uh, I came here in May for a course tour. So I knew what to expect. So, congratulations to three of us, of you. Um, a question for Tamirat: How was the, your route since the bronze medal in Rio? In to the, your last three years, in my opinion, you achieved the best, uh, your best results with a major, Eugene, and here. Yes, uh, after uh, I come from uh, 
the track. Uh, uh, I achieved a lot of uh, marathon race to, to win and also represent my country by world champion in London uh, silver medalist and also in Hujin uh, uh, I'm a champion. So after uh, uh, I lose on uh, Budapest, uh, I come again to Olympic. This is not easy uh, to win, <laughs> but the guide helped me. Uh, I say, uh, for my God, for my uh, team, my all, thank you. Do we have any further questions in the room? Um, yeah, one there, yes, please. A question to Tola. Uh, what was your strategy before the race, your tactics? Was it to be pushing uh, from the beginning, waiting? Uh, yeah, my tactic is to go with, uh, with team, uh, but when uh, Italian guy, athlete we see, it is in front of us, uh, so if we go alone up to 30 kilometers, maybe it is difficult, so can I arrive him to go, May, uh, uh, the team is back, and they come again, uh, I, I decided to go with team. And also the Japan athlete is also again to try to uh, in front. Uh, when he arrived to the hill, he back and decided to go. Yeah. And do we have any further questions online? If not, that uh, concludes our press conference. Thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen. Congratulations to our medalists. Enjoy this evening. Enjoy these medals. And please stop the live stream. Thank you.